Hey guys, uh, this is Justin Porter. Um, I, you've probably never heard of me, but um, that's okay. You probably don't care because I am playing Skyrim and uh, that's really all you need to hear. Um, we're actually gonna fight a dragon, but let me uh, tell you a little bit about myself first. Um, I have been, I'm about 35 hours in. I've been playing a uh, kind of a fighter mage hybrid class. I've, uh, I have a, you can see there, I have a Skyforge steel sword. It looks pretty awesome. I'm actually wearing wolf armor. I don't know what that means, but I'm assuming it's like made of wolves. Doesn't seem like it would be a very good uh, way to make armor, but um, hey, works for me. So uh, instead of, uh, you can see my left hand, I'm actually, uh, using a fire spell um, instead of shield. It's way cooler, I think, to set things on fire than it is to uh, block things. So that's why I decided to do that. Um, so let's go ahead and uh, head up and fight this dragon. Um, you can see behind me, I have my house Carl Lydia. Uh, she's really helpful. She works really well as like a damage sponge when I'm in combat um, because she's pretty much invincible. She like goes down and gets hurt, but she never dies. Um, so basically I can start wailing on things while they wail on her. Uh, works pretty well. It's a, it's a good kind of symbiotic relationship. Um, I think we're both pretty happy with it. Um, so you can hear the dragon. Yep, there he is. Yeah, there's the dragon flying around there. Um, let's go up and see what is going to happen when we head up here. I'm going to guess we're probably supposed to go into this glowing circle of light here because, you know, that's usually the kind of thing you walk into in video games. So, hey, there he is. Uh, apparently he is gonna speak uh, some Dragonese to us. I really have no idea what he's saying, um, but oh, he knocked me down. Uh, first time that happened, I actually thought I was dead. And I was like, wow, that is a cheap death. Um, but then I found out that no, actually, that's not what he's doing. So, let's see here. So I'm gonna go ahead and shoot him to get rid of him. Yeah, I really don't know what you're saying, buddy, and I really don't care. Let's get down to it. All right, so it appears to be a frost dragon. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and buff myself with some potions. I've been playing around with, uh, with alchemy a lot. Um, it's been pretty fun kind of going through and uh, seeing the different combinations that make things. So that's why I have like a thousand potions. Um, all right, so let's go ahead and we can do a fortify health, which I saw just a second ago here. There we go. Um, that'll increase my health a little bit. Uh, and then let's just go ahead and do a resist cold because it looks like he's a frost dragon and uh, resist magic because, uh, hey, why not? That sounds like a, a good thing to do. So um, I'm going to go ahead and switch back to my close up weapons, which are flames and that sword and uh, let's start shooting at him. Oop, oops, sorry Lydia. Oh, he didn't like that too much. So. Let's see, I think he's probably going to stay up there and shoot at us, so let's go ahead and shoot him with an arrow while he's doing it. Just for good measure. A little wake up call. All right, uh, gonna guess he's probably gonna land next, so let's go back to our close up. Maybe not. Yep. And there's some frost. So, I think one thing I've learned about this game is the buffs really play into it a lot. Uh, you can see I barely took any damage from that. That's, um, uh, I think a lot of that has to do with my resist frost potion. He apparently does not want to fight hand to hand. Oh wait, here we go. All right, a little flames, buddy. So let's go ahead and hit him with another arrow. Oh, never mind. So you can see Lydia there soaking up some damage. She's really helpful for that. And 
and there we go. Yeah, we did it. We totally did it. We really did it. And I will take one dragon soul, please. Thank you. And let's go ahead and loot him. Dragons have really, really good loot. Uh, you can see I got some dragon scales there. I was really hoping, I'm really hoping that at some point I can make like a dragon scale armor or something. I, I saw something that looked like that in the loading screen and like I've been kind of all about it ever since. Um, one cool thing is that uh, you can see the uh, dragon skeletons, um, uh, which he appears to, appears to be in sort of a compromising position there, but um, they're persistent, so I can come back to this spot at any point, and uh, I'm pretty sure he will still be there, which is kind of a cool touch, um, Bethesda's part. Um, so, uh, yeah, uh -huh. that is uh, that is a little bit of Skyrim and some dragon killing. <laughs>